And with that, it is my pleasure to welcome His Excellency President William Bruto to give his remarks. Welcome, Excellency.
and must collaborate to achieve a just transition to clean and green industrialization, decarbonize manufacturing, and achieve prosperity through ecologically responsible means. There is an opportunity for us to forge partnerships in developing transformative human, technological, and industrial capacities through education and training, science and technology, research and innovation. We have a chance to make our regions and the whole world safer, more peaceful, and more secure. Now more than ever, our shared future depends on how we align our undertakings and pursue our aspirations in trade, in energy, environment, and climate action, infrastructure development, education and training, agriculture, peace, and security, technology, and innovation. This is why I celebrate our friendship, Mr. Chancellor, because I see in it the power to overcome the multiple, complicated, and ever-changing crises and challenges that confront us at many levels, including the ultimate existential threat of climate change. We are pleased and we are blessed with 60 years of a joint track record of successful collaboration across many domains, which make this moment, this visit at this time, very special. It is time to enlist all our capacities and all our agencies in every sector to consolidate our endowments and anchor them within a strategic partnership framework so that we can address the present effectively and face the future with confidence. Ladies and gentlemen, I know it is after lunch. It's not a place to make speeches. I now invite everyone present to raise their glass and join me in a toast to the good health and long life of His Excellency Chancellor Olaf Scholz and to the prosperity of the people of the Federal Republic of Germany as well as the people of the Republic of Kenya and the everlasting friendship between our two nations. Cheers.